All right, man. Welcome to another episode of Smut Free TV. It's your host, Rockstar2800, the most hated, the most opinionated, the most underrated. You know the rest. This is Rockstar Reactions. But before we get into that, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe ASAP. Become a member to this channel and follow Smut Free TV on Instagram. Hop in the comments because every comment counts. And you know, we got the hottest content in these internet streets. No cap today. We got Brick Baby going at 600. It was going back and forth on internet, on Instagram earlier, going crazy with each other. You know, Brick saying he was going to drop a video at eight, insinuating that he was going to expose some stuff about 600. 600 saying where the video at, where it's at. I'm pulling like what, you know, a lot of confusion. You know what I'm saying? If you don't know, they ran into each other recently at No Jumper the other day when 600 was up there to meet Adam and interview with his artists. Uh, and I guess they ran into each other, end up taking a picture, and you know, it starts going crazy on the internet, whatever. So, I don't know what this is. He's supposed to drop a video, he ended up dropping a live with No Jumper, his new show called Uh No Statements. You know what I'm saying? And he addressed a little bit after that, but then. We were still waiting for the video. I was thinking, oh, then maybe that was just promo for the podcast, right? And come to find out, he ended up dropping a video a little bit later. I think he had to probably edited it a little bit. But we about to listen to this. And y'all let me know what y'all think during the video, after video. Brick is going in on 600. You know, he not feeling all the antics. So we about to get to this. Y'all already know what it is. Stay tuned. This is about, we gonna start at 600. You get what I'm saying? 600. Snow are you, boy? Like, Snow are you, where you come from? You know what I'm saying? You say you FH and all that, whoa, whoa, baby, man, listen. I'm hood. Like, it's a lot of big bodies over there. We was having Thunderdome at Nigga Horace, man, nigga 54th Street, High Park, all that. Where was you at during these Thunderdumps? Because, nigga, you ain't never squabbled no too tall. You ain't never squabbled, nigga, baby boo. You ain't never squabbled in here. All the niggas that's your age, nigga, daddy O's and all that with them big bodies, nigga, on hood. You ain't never ran them fades, nigga. Nigga, 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 tiny grasshopper. Like, nigga, you ain't never ran them fades of them big dudes that was out there squabbling and really locking up. Like, and I. All right, look, look, look. As you can see right now, Brick is breaking it down about who 600 ain't never afraid. Like, basically uh, discredited him. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't nobody know him. You know, and a lot of people been saying this for years. And, and, and you know, it's always been a rumor on who is he? What is he? So Brick is finally exposing and, and you know, putting it out there. I guess enough is enough. It look, he looked fed up. Let's get into it. And I've really been back there while these niggas was programming all. I've never seen that. Nigga, you ain't squabble baby boat, nigga. Uh, look, you ain't never squabble crazy old nigga. When you was tripping, you ain't never been through none of that. Like, nigga, oh, nigga, nigga ain't never squabble deacon. Nigga I ain't never squabble swan talk. Nigga, I don't know the dead homies. Like, his big bodies in the hood. So it's like, we would have heard of these standard on just because that's what niggas do when they, when they do. You know what I mean? What they do hanging out late at the park with no curfew. You know what I mean? So, you know what I mean? You went to Christian, whatever the case is, that's cool. When was your put on date, though? Right. Oh, who put you on? Oh, shit, man. Getting juicy. <laughs> he said, man, who put you on? What was your put on date? This is hilarious. Because there's a story circulating that yo put on was the day at Unique when I guess it was supposed to be, I'm not going to say their names and put all them in, 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 in jeopardy or whatever the case is, nigga. But I don't think so, nigga. You nigga, you ain't squabble them. They're too young. These kids is like, T5 baby you age. They say that they rushed you or whatever, and that was your put on in 2012. 
you are seven or eight years older than me. I got put on in 2002, 2003, somewhere around there. You know what I mean? So he's saying that this guy got put on in 2012. And he's he saying he's 42 right now. Oh, my God. So 10 years. 2022 is 40. So 10 years. So, nah, not 30. I don't know if he's 42. I don't, I don't really know. I, if he is, that's crazy. But so, tw- yeah, that'd be 30, about 28, 29, 30 he got put on, if that's the case. And Brick got put on 2002, 2003. I'm an 03, 04 nigga myself. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah. All right. Here we go. I mean, so you are definitely a lot older than me to be getting put on 10 years later. They say that they, it, it sounds like it was a case of. Nigga, the homies rest you, nigga. Like, nigga, nigga, you got into it with the young niggas and they rest you and ran you up out of the unique studio, wherever it was at, nigga. Nigga, on Crenshaw. Okay. Granted, we never heard your put on story from nobody, from nobody around this motherfucker. So that makes it to the point to where you unofficial. But you official how or you came around through whoever you got but, but, but where was your put on like you ain't never told niggas the niggas that put you down because you got to prove something because you keep on you keep on nigga aggravating the community and doing what you're doing and then you talk about people on paperwork but didn't we ask you to unseal them papers didn't we ask you to unseal them papers so we can see what your crib is really about bro Hey, call on too. Text on one to see where you're at. Tell him to meet me right here. Call on one to see where you're at. Tell him to meet me right here. Yeah, man. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> this nigga Brick got a lot going on. He in traffic. Like mama, wife right there. Baby in the back. <laughs> Brick just got a lot going on. Call with the wool. He trying to talk to us. <laughs> Brick crazy, man. Hey man, you already know his title is Brick Baby says his business never personal assist, honey. So we're gonna keep it rocking and rolling. So like I don't know where my my video just crashed. So wherever wherever I was at, I uh long story short, nigga, you got some paperwork that's unsealed. You talk about this nigga told it's a police statement. You got some unsealed paperwork that we asked you to bring that to the table because you've been doing And shout out to Byron Blake because Byron Blake was the first person to expose that, that he had unsealed paperwork. Official Byron Blake, YouTube, shout out Byron Blake, that's my guy. All this digging and poking. So now nigga, you got to prove yourself too. You got a little explaining it. We need to know when your put on date was. You get what I'm saying? Because the picture, don't let the smoke screen fool you, nigga. Oh, and I don't agree with nothing that Cud got going on, nigga. A nigga, I came to my job early once again. I'm not going nowhere to no jumper early. They tell me be there at a certain time. I came earlier than the time. I guess they was trying to avoid contact. I guess they was trying to avoid contact with uh with cuz because they know you know that he side with the whack my other nigga but cuz is honestly yeah you know I mean a, 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 a friend of mine that ain't thinking right so nigga i ain't trying to do nothing to him or nothing like that i don't agree with none of the shit that he got going on especially for like a stand-up person from the hood that every time that a politic come on it might not be public because he ain't been on the internet but every time when my name come up nigga say nigga i ain't going from day one you know what I mean? And, um, you know what I'm saying? I owe it to Cuz to stand on business when I stand on business. So when I seen, I was walking through, I came to work early, boom. I come through that motherfucker. I walk through the back door. I don't know they recorded the interview. So when I look, I see Cuz. I blase past Cuz. Hey, nigga, but all right, hey, nigga, but whoa, whoa, whoa. Man, I go way in the front. I'm like, Cuz, I'm sick. So, all right, you know, nigga that this is is, is is possibly fit to be a politic. So he's saying that 
he came to work early at the No Jumper store, which they got a podcast in the back now where they be shooting from. And uh, he came there early and so happened 600 of his artists was up in there. So he said he kind of see what's going on, boom. But he go back out, boom. And then he like, ah, you know, like, you know, like, I guess he ended up walking in. Right, I'm going to let him finish explaining it, but it's just, it's like, you know, I don't know what he was expecting. If they was going to be tripping, like, once he's seen that, like, I don't know. I'm about to see what he, I'm going to see where he getting at on this because I'm confused right now. Uh, Tasty. Tell them, right, tell them what part you about. All right, yeah, so when we walk through, I'm like, all right, yeah, I already know what this finna be, cuz. Like, uh, the dad homies, like, nigga, me and cuz, cool. Cuz gonna ask for a picture or something, cuz. When I'm blase, I hear a big U name come out of his mouth like he on pie. You heard me? I, I, I hear a big U Big U name while I'm closing the door, so I tell Adam like, "Hey, you know, we ain't doing the big U shit." Boom, oh, wow, wow. Like, so I wait on Cuz, and I'm like, "Cuz, woo, woo. I fuck with the nigga from Main Street, so if me and DW Flame, you go take pictures with the nigga from Main Street, woo, woo, Cuz, yo, he pushed this Keyway shit, so you know what I mean? Me and me and DW Flame, we on a mission to bring all Keyways together. If it, if the milk ain't." If the spilled milk ain't, ain't too much to get over, we trying to bring all the keyways together. Boom, all right, whatever. Boom. So now, cub walk out. Boom. On six so Hey, on the dead on me, bro. Like, woo woo. Like, you know, I fuck with you. I don't know how I cub, but your push, like, I can't get caught up in no internet shit with you. Cause I don't fuck with your push on the internet. Nothing. Now, mind you, we're in our work in the workplace, cub. On six so so he's saying he addressing 600 right now with the issue. Like, this is what it is. I ain't feeling none of that. So I'm going to keep on hearing it. So now niggas take a picture of Cub out saying, I'm like, uh, he like, you ain't going to get in this one, Cub. I'm like, uh, uh, nigga, now mind you, it's insane, niggas. I mean, there's people around, Cub. Me, immediately, I'm on my, uh, look, can't show no internal inside, some outside around the, the outsiders, good because I'm giving them fuel for they, you know what I mean? Motherfucker might like to see it, not DW, cuz, you know what I mean? So, so, wow. He like, you ain't gonna, all right, cuz I hop in the picture, cuz y'all see my, my body language. Y'all know I'm usually gun up and all that. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm gun down, oh man. I'm hood, but I, I, I tell niggas don't post the picture. You know what I'm saying? Don't post the picture, cuz I'm a dead homie, cuz. Ooh, ooh, like, y'all niggas don't even post that picture. Like, mind you, I'm at the workplace. You know what I'm saying? Now, if I tell a nigga, fuck, no, what's going on? You know what I mean? Now a nigga got to uh, uh, text T and tell him that we put in that too. Tell him to go to the... Uh... Yeah, yeah, nah, it's... It's it. Nah, so... Nigga, whatever the case is, I tell you, I don't fuck with your push, cuz I ain't trying to, nigga, oh, uh, nigga, I'm gonna crash out by my own name, and I ain't sticking with no other, no red rag to go against the keyway, long story short, mile, cuz I ain't see the, 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 the video that he had posted on Big U right before that, right? Hi, my name oh, is Rachel, oh, yeah. and I would like to... What's up with this nigga? This nigga phoned and dropped and shit, man. I'm glad it went to skip all that, man. We're gonna get back to it. This nigga that dropped the phone and shit. Oh, oh good. I ain't see the video that he posted on Big U right before that at all. You know what I'm saying? I ain't know that he just got at my pint of foul. So, you know what I mean? Like, I'm thinking cuz I ain't said nothing. You know what I mean? Whatever it came. See, but that's the right there. That's kind of hard for me to believe. It's just like 600 been running a campaign on the internet, a big you smut campaign. You understand? So it's hard for me to believe like you don't like he been making. So you probably didn't see that video that day, but you've been seeing some stuff like you had to. Everybody has. I don't even be trying to look for it. 
It's just in the algorithm. He just all he do is talk about big you all day. This is all six hundred does. Everybody knows this. Case is in this a business movie. I know jump better. Fuck that picture, cuz on the hood, I'm not solidifying no type of crib coming from cuz as far as that, cuz mm. then it's like, cuz nigga, why nigga, since you just the face of the hood and niggas names tarnished in the south, cuz like, why you ain't pulled up to the safe to get your chili cheese fries like you usually get your <laughs> chili cheese fries? You nigga, every day you pull up, you go get your chili, nigga, you ain't been in the set, you ain't been pulling up. Cause on the dead, um, you talking about niggas that never see you again in the flesh and all that shit. Cause, but then you saying that you the king or something, and now you ruffling feathers, talking about some shit down in the south, nigga. You run the south first and foremost, cause we know who the king is, cause down there, bro. I don't know his name, but you know, come on, cause it's two niggas, and on six so crip, nigga. It just been like that, cause you get what I'm saying. We ain't got to put too much emphasis on that, cub. But, nigga, you talk about nigga name tarnished, whatever the case is. For man, man oh, look, you don't get to make that call, cub. Mm. On the dead, um, then you talk about you got money for cuz, nigga, the squabble and all that, cub. Cub offered you a squabble. Cub put you on camera. You was on the side of cub house. On the dead homies, cut offered you to get back there, cut you broke it down on camera before you could even get to the backyard. Never made it to the backyard. Oh, six so crip told him that you didn't want to squabble and all that. Now all of a sudden you want to squabble, cut. Oh, six so that's weird shit. That's weird shit, cuz and you keep publicizing for the internet. Like I was telling another homie, cuz on oh, six so we was kids, it wasn't no internet. So when you wanted to get out of nigga. Like, if we catch you saying fuck a nigga two, three times, cuz, and you ain't really went to go pull up on cuz and, and get your issue out the way, now a snitch on six up crib is ten times different, cuz. You got to whoop cuz feet, cuz. All the homies got to whoop cuz feet. Ain't no pull up on cuz for no head up fade and all that, cuz. You tell you get put off or you get your ass smacked, nigga. But on six up crib, you ain't been to the hood to get no chili cheese fries, cuz. You ain't, nigga, nigga. You ain't been over there because to, to wherever you pulled up the first time, I'm pretty sure it's still space and opportunity over there for a fade cuz. It's like you doing everything to go against the hood because at the same time, when you want the hood, you know what I mean, to be behind, like, like and everybody two-faced cuz. You got the niggas that you think is there for you cuz, nigga, behind your back trying to put together sit-downs cuz and all that shit with people that... To, 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 to smooth shit out the way, cuz. And on the dead homies, nigga, they probably still feed the nigga, feed the nigga, feed the nigga all the bullshit. Like, you get what I'm saying? Like, cuz, and you the torpedo that's going for it, cuz, because you looking for validation at 42. Niggas don't look for validation at 42, cuz. Nigga, 42? Say it ain't so. Don't think so, Chris. Go pull up, address your issue. Nigga, pull up to the set, nigga, go live, nigga, three days in a row, nigga, like how you used to. Y'all go do all that, cause I, I ain't the nigga that go to the set and drop my location. I'd have been popped too many times. And niggas know I don't play with this thing, cuz. On the dead homies, niggas know I don't do no playing with this motherfucker. Any nigga hating cuz on 6 0, that's where they hate stop. Cause they know they gotta be ready when they see me. Any nigga from the section, any op nigga on 6 0, you ain't never pulled up on me with that energy, nigga. And it didn't go the way I wanted it to go, nigga. On oh, six so crit, nigga. Unless I was just giving it to you, like, all right, I hear you out, nigga. I hear a nigga out, nigga, but a nigga gonna keep his hands to itself. I bet that nigga on West Side Road, nigga. You hear what I'm saying? So, nigga, I'm hood. You got some, you got some popping out to do, my boy, cuz on oh, six so, nigga. Don't think that, nigga, cuz I got the biggest platform. You came to no jumper, nigga. I pulled up there on accident. Nigga, we took a pit. No, that doesn't validate nothing that goes on in the 60s, boy. You still on the run from the hood, and you not going to pull up to go get your fade. You not going to pull up over there to go get your chili cheese fries. You're not going to be seen in the flesh again, gang. So this thing you about to say them chili cheese fries. I ain't going to lie, they fire at hell with so those losses. That shit gas. So just keep that and run with it and keep the hood out your mouth, gang. Oh, six, so until you unseal that paperwork, 
come to the set, get your issue. And like I be telling you, before all this shit, hey, don't get up on one of them niggas that do something to one of them niggas, cuz you still have yet to do that, cuz. So I don't think so, cuz the brick ain't 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 stamping nothing about no 60 business. He's a cool businessman. I see him moving around and all that. That's where that that's that. You get what I'm saying? Other than that, cuz on the dead on these nigga with this neighborhood shit, it's a rap, cuz. Oh six so nigga don't be late. Oh yeah. That nigga said with this neighborhood shit, it's a rap. Man, what y'all think about this video, man? This is crazy, man. Break really pressing on, on on like I ain't feeling him. I'm not condoning none of that. He he definitely staying on his side with this. Standing his ground, standing on business, as you should say. Uh, seems like a lot of smut right now is on 600. We're trying to figure out what is going on, man. Why is all this spilling out onto the internet? It's a lot to unfold. It's a lot to unfold. So y'all let me know what y'all think in this vi about this video. You already know it's Rockstar Reactions. Brick Baby goes in on 600. You already know. Like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Become a member to this channel. Also, follow Smut Free TV on Instagram. Hop in them comments because what? Every comment counts. And you know, we got the hottest content in these internet streets. No cap.